some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in the Vallejo County School District area with the Bay Area Transparency as he attempts to wander the halls of a school for some reason. I mean, uh, why are you doing this, dumbass? I mean, are you trying to bait the police into a confrontation with you because you have a grudge against one of them? Yeah, I suppose that's what it is because because that's pretty much what the premise of your video was early on. But I'm not going to go and show you all that because it's well over an hour long. I'm just going to go ahead and show you the arrest of this stupid moron. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. See, this is the thing. I'm a peaceful, nonviolent person. But when you try to when you try to stop me from moving in a place I know I can move, I'm not gonna sit there. I'm not gonna hurt you or hit you, even though I could, because you were literally committing a crime against my person. Look, dumbass, this is a school. You don't get in here just because you feel like it. In fact, most schools these days are pretty much sealed up and locked up. Because douchebags like yourself came up with this crazy idea to uh, get strapped and uh, do something that, in, that well, unalives a lot of people. So, why don't you get a damn clue, you freaking moron, and realize you can't be doing this? But I will push my way around you. Um, and there's no reason he should have ever did that. So, you got Garcia, who's not very knowledgeable who says that if they want me arrested, he can arrest me. And I would gladly let him because then we have a lawsuit. Oh, this guy's not involved, but these other people are. And we have a lawsuit that we don't need. It's pointless. Oh my goodness, dude. You can be trespassed from public property and private property and government property. How many times do you have to go through this and not get any lawsuits because you want to be an idiot and keep on trying? So since you decide to play F around and find out, well, you F'd around and now you're about to find out. Well, that's what it is, Bay fam. Look at this shit. He got this... It's funny, see, I hear these people laughing, and like I said earlier, that when I come back here in a week or two, it won't be that. It won't be laughing, it'll be yes sir, no sir. So if, he, if he comes back here in a week or two, it won't be that. They're laughing. <laughs> if I come back in a week exactly. or two, it won't be that. Exactly. Yeah, it won't, it won't be, it won't be laughing, it'll be yes sir, no sir. <laughs> Well, aren't you a smug little SOB? I'm sure you're uh, ever so popular in the local jail system with Bubba and the boys, and I'm sure that this is just a ploy to get back in there so you can go in and see them because they miss you a lot. It's not. Most of the time it is. Most most are copy and pasted. Well, that's a, that's a penal code. But your policy, somewhere in your policy, it probably says that you guys have to say your name to members of the public. So we got right here, this is one of the individuals who was obviously an inbred member of the, the here family. And uh, the reason why you're supposed to verbalize it, even if it's not in your policy, we got the American with Disabilities Act, people can't read, they can't write, they can't see, you verbalize your name. Well, f your policy, if it's not there, it should be. Plain and simple. And I'm not trying to start it with you. It's just you should you should verbalize your name. That may be true with somebody who has a, an actual issue with uh, hearing or blindness. But you, you are perfectly fine. You can read that badge just fine because I've seen you read. I know there's nothing wrong with your eyes. So drop the freaking act and act like a damn human. Instead of something that the uh, maggots vomited up. He's, he's soliciting them to close the building. Why are you soliciting them to close the building, sir? Clo close it. You'll be held responsible by the people. So Tax dollars pay for this building. Am I being detained? Yes, you're, you're in my way conducting. I'm just trying to make it. I don't have to go down here. 
It's a public area. Open to the public. I ain't being detained. That dude's a piece of straight piece of trash. I don't, you guys can ask all you want. <laughs> Go. You want privacy? Take it private. This is a decent human. You know what's not decent is telling somebody they can and can't go somewhere that's open. You want privacy? Make it f***ing private. It's that simple. Yeah, they, they're going to create the privacy by removing your sorry ass out of the building that you are not authorized to be in anyway and that you were asked to leave numerous times, but you are just too much of a hard-headed moron to figure that out, out that there are some places that you don't belong. And in this case... This is that place, and you belong out on the street, not here. You guys ain't here for a crime. This ain't an investigation of a crime. You guys shouldn't even be here. Bunch of clowns. It's not cool. That dude's a straight mark right there. Sucker. Yeah, I'm talking about you. There you go. Let's get this guy. They're done talking. To Garcia, look behind you. They're done talking to him. Okay. He's gone. Well, he I wants go. you over here away from this. Am so. I being detained? No, Am I being detained? I can totally walk up on the guys. Okay, everything's done. No, you, got, are you guys stopping my movement? At no, this no. point, yes, because Tom he's Bain obstructing. Bain. Tom Bain. Okay. Obstructing right now, what? They're doing an what? investigation. What? Why are you investigating? You're here for a long crime. You're not investigating a crime. This dude's a piece of shit. What's going to happen? I'm sorry, what'd you say? I said you're a piece of shit. Okay, so what's gonna happen? Yeah, there he goes, fishing for an arrest by calling the lead guy a piece of shit. He's gonna want to get some go away money, and that's what he's here for. He wants that frivolous lawsuit money. So let's carry on. What's, what's gonna happen? He's, 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 he's uh, you know, that's, that's not an assault. Pushing me? That's an assault. What's your use of force before. policy? That's called what's your use of force. Out of my way so of force. Up my it's called the use of force. Yeah. Well, you step up again, I'm gonna show you a little more use of force. You want privacy taken in a private office? No, I don't have to take it anywhere. Yes, Whatever I stand on, that's where I own when I'm conducting my business. Do you understand me? You do. Oh, really? Yes, really. This is what's gonna happen. What's your name, Badge? This is what's gonna happen. What's your name, Badge? This is what's gonna happen. Name and badge. If he shuts down business for the day, I don't need any of your directives. If he shuts down business for the day, they're out of here. What's your name, Badge? Walk out, or you'll be taken out. Name and badge number. Name and badge number. I don't break the law with like that. You do. Clown. Name and badge number. So well, we all know that you have a criminal record, dude. I mean, you're a damn frauditor, and we've seen you get arrested on several occasions. I mean, damn. Uh, that officer doesn't have a criminal record, unlike you, do you freaking moron. So get over it. If they shut down, I'm out of here, but I'll hold them accountable. You're not gonna walk There's through. nobody here. You guys ain't... What are you investing? I don't care. your captain and your chief. The way you guys act is trash. Now, quit blocking my flow. You guys aren't investigating anything anymore. And it's very clear. Exactly, I can go through. He's not talking to dude. I said that a minute ago. Real simple. Now, what's your name badge number? I'm just trying to get your name for the record, sir. Don't put your hands up again. I can put my hands put up. up. Put them up again. Put my hands up wherever I want. Put my hands up wherever I want. What are you going to do? Want to be tough guy? Without that badge and gun, is you're not tough. Closing it? Are we closing it? So I can bounce? No? I think you bounce everywhere. You this, is their, this, is their, this is their bitch ass lieutenant who's a tough guy because he has a badge and a gun. And the only reason why you uh, are acting tough is because you're hiding behind that camera. If you didn't have it, then you wouldn't be doing this at all because you're playing to an audience. I mean, that much is for sure. You want to do it for your clicks and views. Without that shit, not so tough. Coward, I can see it in his eyes. <laughs> I'm, I'm letting you know. I'm telling. I'm looking at you right here in front of everybody. You're a coward, and you're a, and you're a law violator. It's funny that the police who are don't supposed so to be the good guys, I'm walking. I don't can walk so in the public area. Back up. Don't push me. Push. Okay. Well, I guess you just didn't know when to shut your mouth, which is always your problem because I know. I've watched a number of your videos, and that's always how it ends up with you in handcuffs. You talk and talk and talk until, well, the handcuffs come out, and you still keep on talking. I mean, it's just the way it is with you. Some frauditors stop when the handcuffs come out, and they'll walk away. I've seen DMA and Long Island Audit walk away when the handcuffs go, go out, but not every single time. But every time they come out with you, you continue to run your mouth until they put them on you. But at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you 
on the next one.